Let's work out problem number four. So we have two functions, f of x equals x squared and g of x equals 6x minus 2. And the question is, what is f o g of x? So we have to compute f o g of x. So first, this is the same thing as f of g of x. That's the first thing you want to do. So you put g into f basically, right? So you put g into f. So this is f of, and then now you just replace g with what it is. So g is 6x minus 2. So you just replace it with 6x minus 2. Okay, so all we've done is replace g with what it is, 6x minus 2. All right, so now we have to look at f. So f of 6x minus 2, that's what we have to compute or evaluate. So f of x is up here. So this is our x. So all we do is replace all of the x's with 6x minus 2. So this is 6x minus 2 squared. And then you can multiply this out. You can take a shortcut or you can FOIL. Um, let's be pro. Let's take the shortcut. So if you recall, if you have a minus b squared, the formula says you square the first term. You multiply these, and then you multiply times 2, so minus 2ab. And then you square the last term. Okay? So the same thing here. This is your a, so you square it, so 36x squared. You multiply these two, so that'll be 12x, and then times 2 is 24x. Then you square the last one, so 4. All right, moment of truth. Let's see if our choice is there. And it is. It's choice A. So A is the answer. That's it.